Ah, it's worked. Tuesday the 11th of August. Hello everybody, welcome. It is uh, I and brother Kelvin, Kevin, a living legend himself. We, uh, sorry about the delay there, it's, uh, he didn't want to let us go live, so. Kev, you want to say what, what, and uh, speak Hello, to the fan? Hope we're all right, enjoying the sunshine and the heat. It's more oppressive from the sun. Oh my God! <laughs> Sorry, you broke up then. <laughs> you know, just saying, we're more. We're either being oppressed by the sun. Oh my God! Can we ever be free? Never mind. It's all good. Good afternoon, everybody. Hope you're well. Much love to you all. All in good spirits here, although a little sweaty. <laughs> Isn't it? Uh... Bloody scorcher! This one, uh, I bet everyone's everyone's at the beach, at the beaches, looking at the peaches. I yield. <laughs> Said too much. Don't nope, leave it. No sexist comments on here, David. Looking at peaches. Mm, I know. <laughs> How many dare you? I've just shared the um, the chinwag, and um, we will sit. It might be active. It might not. Yeah, I don't know what to. Fill the gaps with there, brother. But we did say a special live at five topic live born birth certificate question and answers. We need some questions, is what we need, Kev. Yeah, some questions. I'll think of one for you. Oh, no, no. <laughs> um, I'll scroll down the post though while we're waiting. If there's any news or updates or anything to uh, to say. I can't see anything in the room at the moment, to be honest. I can't see any comments. Can't see nothing. 12 likes on the horsey human knowledge, uh, horseplay, uh, nay nay. I like that. I'm not going to nag, nag you about that one. <laughs> Straight out of the gate. Fucking hell. I hooved it out. I hooved it out. <laughs> hooved it. <laughs> I want a different course. I want a different course. So, uh, Gabriella, oh, hello. Why the long face? Anyway. Not, not you, Gabriella, the horse. Um, no, yeah. sorry. <laughs> We're back on the horses, Gabriella, you'll speak. I haven't seen your face, but I don't imagine it's horse shape. Moving on. Oh, there. Why have I got nothing in FB then? Oh, are they decking with me? The little back. Oh, is Bostock still posting in on it then? Uh, aye, aye, of course he is. Uh, yeah. Oh, what's yeah, this about? Lad. Go on, what's going on he's here? Good He's been, yeah, he's been quite busy last... Actually, he reappeared about a month ago-ish. Really sort of back on it. Falling well, coconuts. Daniel. That's, uh, I like that. Uh, more jokes. <laughs> Keep the jokes rolling. Yeah. Yeah. I put up a couple of jokes today, actually. Some on my timeline and down some right humorless sad people decide to come along, mate pointless comment what was clearly a joke um, and uh, I, I just have given up suffering fools gladly I'm really disappointed by certain people so goodbye thanks for all the fish yeah <laughs> okay. it's uh, some some energies in this uh, game um, there's many and various uh, at the end of the day if we give information out and, uh, you know, we have a laugh and there's joke and that, we can tell sometimes through the text the, uh, or we can we think we can tell and repeatedly thinking you can tell is telling you that if you're repeatedly thinking something, there must be a reason why you're repeating that. See uh, Superhuman, that uh, documentary there about extrasensory perception, quantum level entanglement and uh, consciousness on a whole new level, next level. So we do see... Um, unfortunately, a need to protect and reserve ourselves, and we try to include you all and share, you know, the fun, the jolliness, and some of you, us, man, you know, the, the ones in here don't seem to appreciate uh, all, or you go, um, you know, uh, taking stuff and giving it to other people and not uh, saying hello to us, so we're quite careful and guarded and jaded, but... It's a sad way to be, really. Most of them, I'd like to say, that I've interacted with that do speak, like Lindsay there, Ahmed. There's a good, there's a good lad there. Lindsay's a sister, lad. Ga Gabriella. Yeah, they, we have we have uh, respect and honour and love for, but uh, not everybody does, do they? They come into. I can't see Gabriella. That's the weird thing. I've got Lindsay. Hello, Lindsay. 
Zaheer, mate, how are you doing? Um, just as a quick one, Zaheer, to you, my brother, I have spoken to Brother David here, um, but we've just forgotten to tell you. <laughs> uh, more than happy, if you want a brief chat at some point with Dave about what we were discussing, I do believe David is conducive to that situation, mate. So I haven't got any infections. Conducive? I don't know. Yeah, yes, all right. Yeah. Yeah, Sorry. No, I, didn't, <laughs> I didn't say you were contagious. You are a bit contagious, actually. <laughs> we will make it happen, um, Ahmed. Zahir, um, I know who you are. We've met, fist bumped, hugged, and... Um, Put the world to right a couple of three times, haven't we? So, yeah, it'd be an honour and a privilege, my man. Um, but go, and, man. go We will do that uh, in order of... As you can see, we're busy, we're under pressure, there's expectations and uh, the room, the fam, the trust, the, uh, you know, the consensus is not all on the same page. So, we are aware that there are... We call them trills, we call them leeches, we call them uh, agents, we call them uh, Satan and etc so we're aware and we uh, we know how what we give away and when we give it away but we've had a chat and um, it's about time these stupid little bits of paper um the other people have got by the way you know those on your friends list that are in the game with you looking for stuff but then when they find it they suddenly disappear and you don't see them again <laughs> oh yeah there's that old chestnut and uh, you know, we thought, should we come out and tell everybody? It's, it's just a bit of paper from a hospital, really. You know, it's what you do with it that counts. But everybody deserves the access, the rights to a, a live-born certificate. Or even, we've said before, that's not the be-all and end-all for me. The hospital where um, my mum, uh, you know, gave, uh, gave me life and I popped out, that's gone. So for me, it's been a journey of uh, goose chasing because the hospital is not there. It was said five years ago, Dave, get to your hospital. Your live born certificate is medical data. It only resides at the hospital. It goes in their archive. There may be copies going to Italy, Vatican, blood, weight, and etc. You've got the Office of National Statistics. And I'm like, oh yeah, we have, haven't we? Yeah. So uh, I went for the hospital. It's shut down. And the Registrar General in the Warwickshire County there and the town of said, you need to go uh, looking elsewhere. We don't know what you're on about. So they should know, but they don't know. They're in the game, but they deliberately closed the door. We went to Liverpool. We, you know, I went on a lot of energy here. I'm not an idiot. I am knowingly sometimes. But uh, when the need arises, I can uh, apply the aptitude and focus and get on with the job. And uh, I haven't been looking for this for five years neither. But others have been. And others have found it um, for whatever reason. They're looking for it and they keep it quiet. And there are others out there. It's, you know, it should be your right. Certain things Kevin and I see as your right. And whether you're not or you are supporting us in the private or you do engage, uh, you know, have a engage. Oopsie. There's a red, there's a mark for me that if you do participate in it, you know, and uh, or even if you don't, we still love you the same. Even if you're an agent of Satan. Believe it or not, we don't hate you. We don't hate anybody. Hate's a strong word. We don't wish anybody ill. We want to try and change things. So I'm going to yield and let Kev speak and reflect upon all of that. Right. Yeah, well, any agents of darkness, you are much loved. Aren't they? At any time you're ready to come over to the light, we are here for you. Apart from that, carry on with your crap work. <laughs> We've all got the dark side. Good. Yeah, we've all got a yeah, dark side. Yeah, we've all got a dark side. <laughs> equilibrium, <laughs> equity. <laughs> uh, Joe Mink, hello. Nick, brother, how you doing? Good to see you. Thanks for popping by. It's a bit of an impromptu one, and then we got jerked around. And I'm just going to throw in the word souverain just to get Dave worked up a bit. <laughs> oh, souverain. <laughs> I did like that, and uh, I like it that uh, Romley Stewart and Rohan and other channels and other Facebook groups and other Facebook uh, man's uh, profiles are now emulating. They don't want to speak to us. They sit and watch, and, you know, this isn't aimed at anybody specifically. It's aimed at a lot. There are honourable ones out there, but it's not, you know, we ask for help. We ask for uh, interaction and support, um, working uh, together for the good cause of all, and, um, yeah, it's just... It's either a coincidence, purplethumbprinces.com, <laughs> and uh, the way that that's been done, or man's took note and man wants to do it themselves. You know, uh, I did try and get in touch with many and various, and the ones that have answered and allowed, we've made contact with Santos, Josh, 
Um, you know, there's quite more than that. Flat Earth Dude, Sun and Moon, there's a long list. But the ones that don't want to get in touch, stay quiet. But then, you know, it's, uh, it's just sad, isn't it? You know, so we're here today to take your questions, field your questions to us about anything you want to know about how to obtain your live birth certificate. So I've uh, involved Kevin with this when I made the phone call to the um, offices and uh, I'll tell you what's happened if your hospital is shut where you was um, born into this realm and then uh, I'll tell you what you need to do or I'll, yeah, I'll inform you and then tell you or uh, Kev's got some info on it as well just as I have. Um, have you got your live born certificate, birth certificate for um, that event because it's an event your person is obviously the ship created at registration so we have um, a period of time after coming out of mum's waters and being um, what is the word is it birthed yeah when the ship sits in the yes. water it's birthed and so that's why we got birth because it's a ship sitting in water but it's man in a pool of blood placenta and etc so it's really dark when we say satanic agents of so these are the agency darknesses that we encumbrance here birth a birth certificate well birth includes stillbirth so it excludes birth what i know incredible darkness so um we have issues with then going to the registry office you know like everybody does because it's normal and then losing that um inherent uh, unalienable uh, access on different levels different words and we get uh, attached to a national debt via the constitutional and uh, lose our uh, I don't know what the word is there, pursuits of freedom. So we've uh, we've got some digging done and we've uh, we've had some answers and I've made several phone calls and um, I've had answers and they're looking for them as we speak. So um, that's the first time in about 10 attempts over five years something positive has happened. Any questions, um, I will field or Kev will field them and it will be our honour and privilege to, uh, to uh, inform you, yeah, I suppose. Yeah, can I, can I just throw in as a reminder everybody about Dave for some some of the info Dave's put out recently. Constitution won't help you in this case. <laughs> it's part of the, it's part of the the trickery <laughs> because of what it sees you as. Mm. So and same as equity. Equity aids yeah. persons and God is no respecter of persons. So when we said equity is the you know it's it is and it isn't for liability and like the foreign offshore trust with the um, spiders web documentary that you may have seen me narrating on and covering on that six hour hangout with myself is reasons and things that uh, yeah it's very complicated but uh, we got a question I'm happy to say did either of you um, hello Nick thank you uh, did either of you see my comment on the dot com as where would one go if born at home and if one is born at home then um, I believe at some point there is a weighing a checking by a midwife a midwifery report or something should I haven't checked this out but uh, um, home birth somebody at some point needs to come along and say hello what what we're from X and uh, we'd like to just check um, on little baby you know and uh, yeah. mum so exactly my situation I was telling you yesterday wasn't I last night was it we had a chat yeah yeah exactly my situation Nick Born in the pub, mate. <laughs> That's where I was born. In the pub that my parents ran. And, and um, that is exactly where I was born. And it, just a brief true story. My mother's upstairs. I'm the third one to come along, by the way. My father is in It's a tall townhouse property uh, in Devon. So my father's in the cellar on a Sunday morning doing the stock take, you know, for the order. Mum's upstairs screaming, she's in labour, and the doctor turned up, no midwives, the doctor came up, by the time my father realised what was going on and he came up doing the order, I was already there. <laughs> you fell out? So, yeah, my, my father had none of it. My father was staying down with the alcohol, like the fine professional drinker that he was. <laughs> and, I, and I have inherited those traits, I come from a long line of professional alcoholics, I know you all know. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, uh, Prince Albert Ilfracombe High Street is still there Ilfracombe North Devon <clears throat> where else but they've put some comments in there nice one there Nick so um, it would appear that um, before 
19, what is it, 40, late 30s after the 1931 incident, gold, debt, insolvency, bank, etc. Um, there was a certification introduced and a removal of the Bible. So, yeah, I'm not going to say you're that old where, you know, you, you, you've got uh, paperwork. We need to look at this and uh, I will ask the question tomorrow when I speak to the office. I've put on the dot com all the details of the offices. So um, the number that I gave out was the national, um, was it the Office of National Statistics, uh, ONS. And they directed me to the hospital when I said, uh, I believe there's been an error um, I'd like to talk to you five minutes. I'm paying the call. You're the uh, operative agent. Is that okay? And they said, yes. I said, do you understand legalese? They said, no. I said, I do. I said, do you speak Oxford babble as in the concise standard default language? He went, yes. I went, are you legally trained? He said, no. I went, fine. I goes, I'm etymologically knowledgeable and I'm quite a linguistic master in some arts of the darkness of the legalese and the church like chattel. I said, that's a word. I want to make a note of that make a note of chattel, chattel, and check out what that is. I said, moving forward, persons, God's not a respecter of. I have my person from registration. That's what it actually is, the birth certificate. I said, and birth includes still. I'm sorry, mums and dads, if this upsets you, this topic, but this is the realm we're in, and we're going we're, we're to eradicate it one way or the other. So I said to him, that includes that, which means that if it includes exclusive or alterious Latin that Romley and Rohan picked up upon and started to then change directions with, uh, after we had a chat on the, uh, YouTube, that means the inclusion of one is the exclusion of other. You need to look at the word include and you need to look at the word includes and also the interpretation acts. And so, uh, not the acts, uh, the, uh, yeah, the interpretation acts and how government speaks, yeah. language in itself, styles, uh, capacity status it's all you know relevant so uh, i'd like to know how i would correct the fact that if i can prove to you that i man david have my person mr david jeremita and i believe that you've issued and by mistake this is why i rang the office of national statistics and randomly the other morning i went you've made a mistake somewhere by including still and not including birth so i'm here to tell you I'd like the live born birth, you know, uh, sheet there because I've got some estates and proclamations, declarations to do. And I don't want to be doing it with something that includes death and not life. And he says, ah, I know what you mean. I went, whoa, I nearly fell down. I tell thee now, I know what you mean. I went, wow, which bit about what I want or what I've just said. And he went, what you want and what you've said. So I broke through. <laughs> and I think these calls are recorded. I bet he gave that one to his manager. And, uh, <laughs> Marlene. Anyway, so um, he said, I know. To the CIA. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a drop. That was better than a Q drop for him. I'm telling you now, if he's a Q follower as well and he had that call, he probably went home and parted. Um, man's waking up kind of party. So I said to him, what do we need to do to obtain this document if the hospital... Um, has got it then, yeah. I approached them and asked for the archive area because he said it's the hospital, not the registrar, not the government there as such, but the National Trust of the, oh, what did he say? The Hospital Trust, sorry, the uh, National um, Hospital Trust, is it uh, National NHS? Can't even think of the words, Kev. The heat. Yeah, it's done, yeah. NHS Trust, yes. National yes. Hospital Service or something like that. National, National Health Service. Health, there we go. I'm just testing you. And I says, oh, he says, it only resides there and that's where you'll get it from. So I then said to him, ah, the hospital's no longer there. And he said, I'm not sure what they do. And um, he says, you'll have to ring up uh, the, the borough, the county, and ask for where the archives have gone. It may have gone to a new hospital that's been built and replaced. Um, I ended up bringing a museum in Coventry today and spoken to a lovely lady called Victoria and um, she said we haven't got that it's in the new hospital in your borough of uh, you know origin um, original origination so uh, I went okay she didn't use them words I'm just uh, jazzing it up so I said uh, I will ring that and I rang the hospital of the newness in the uh, origin area and they said here's the email address I was like whoa hang on a minute Ooh, need a minute, it's 40 degrees in this van and uh, all right then. So I took the email address and I've put in the uh, the request um, via the, the website actually, it was a web address and um, I'm waiting on an answer. So uh, if um, when they reply, or I'll send another email or you can email or call the Office of National Statistics, Nick. 
Don't believe Dave. Don't believe Kev. Don't, don't, don't believe the hype. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but that's it. We do it. Find it. Ring up. You know, don't believe YouTube. Don't believe I. Don't believe Kev in the nicest, lovingest way. Check shit out because there may be an error, an omission, a mistake, or somebody may be pulling your leg and wasting your time. You see? Setting you up with a purple, with setting you up with a purple thumbprint instead of a different colour, which you may need instead of purple. Unless Russell knows something we don't. Watch that space. It will be interesting, won't it? That one, Kev. Yes, indeed. <laughs> indeed, it will. But it's just not. You see, as I said to David when he was recounting this very tale to me. Isn't it amazing when you speak to the right departments? <laughs> they fucking they know what you're talking about. Ah, it's amazing. So yeah, you've it's got lovely. to be at the right department, and you service thing thinking, yeah, they're going to cut me off as a loom bag, and they go, oh yeah, okay, yeah, that's fine, yeah, we get that. You, you speak to another department, they're not talking about. Unbelievable. So that yeah, the, the local offices, like the registry in your local town or city or county. Uh, this is for well, we didn't do a thing. This is mostly for England then, because I don't know how hospitals and registrars and securities exchange commissions and bondage and that works in uh, all. Yeah, bondage, correct. Um, all other uh, Commonwealth uh, ex colonies that have found their independence. You see, because when the Commonwealth collapsed. What London did is opened its doors and housed all these uh, international, and we can prove it, and it's on the spider's web, so the Commonwealth still exists in the form of this. When we saw the demise, the secret Commonwealth, oh why London, the crown, you know, that's how the Commonwealth, is. that's why it's here, and that's why William the Conqueror, I suppose, uh, in way 1067, uh, made that agreement, and ever since then, land tenure, doomsday, yeah, it's... Uh, very prevalent i feel quite sick if q and trump don't deliver nasara jasara spl's kevin dave i've got a backup and uh, it's happening isn't it brother <laughs> yeah but it won't be no gold involved <laughs> no imaginary gold <laughs> <laughs> oh, i see gold gained um, 10 pound a gram if anybody did invest as yeah. we speculated have you seen the price of gold what well done if you've invested you're going to make yeah, a pretty penny on that. Well done. Yeah. Was it about 15... Last time I looked, which was just a few days ago, it was 15... 115 quid an ounce. Uh, I think it's top two, $2,000 in the States. Or it's... It might have even gone over that now. Not, I'm not 100% sure, but they were like 1998 or something when I had a look a few days ago. Gotcha. All right. I'm look. I'm looking at Lindsay. Uh, not looking. At, sorry. I'm looking at Lindsay. <laughs> no. I'm looking at Lindsay's comment. Born in the local maternity home, which was knocked down a few years ago, but our hospital is still there. Yeah. First place to check the local hospital closest to that. I ring around. Did all of them explain. Um, uh, you will need to take obviously proofs. There's data protection here. Um, they can't be put online. I've asked why. Uh, why, why I have to do it this way I said is there no archive repository where I can just because the hospital's gone I'd like to access it myself and just manage it like I did with the birth certificate put in the order and the commercial aspect and it gets sent out um, with no human interaction as such so she said no because of the data and everything and how it is we'd have to each one has to be I'm like oh in persona we call that in the in the private side of law but uh, I'm, I call it mono e mono you know and uh, um, ring up the national the Office of National Statistics, sorry, and um, your Registrar General won't tell you nothing, your Chancery Master doesn't tell you nothing, YouTube um, has found out, but have kept it secret, and various Facebook groups, and possibly um, I would bet my um, my uh, left foot, oh, I'm willing to sacrifice that, that somebody I know has obtained all of this and gone further and kept it quiet. Who's on the friend's uh, you know, side, uh, brotherly, brotherly love, peace and love, bro. Yeah, of course, yeah, yeah, nice one. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. Yeah, love you. Love stealing from you. <laughs> we know not everybody's negative, but we'd rather come in here. This is how we are. We'd rather come in here and put the, the, the money on the table, the words where the mouth is, and say, 
probably 20% are going to use this and do wrong with it and try and profit and say, I found out this, look what, but we don't care because we've got bigger fish to fry and there's a lot of pressure. We're all a bit, uh, um, I don't know how to put this, but uh, pissed off and um, skeptical. Matt, Boris, all the cronies, I, uh, I don't recognise them. You saw the notice that I put up, public notice there. And uh, we, uh, we know that 80% are loving and we, we, we won't uh, sacrifice them 80%, so the 20%, you know, won't get. We'll give it to everyone because the universe and the consciousness um, has told us to behave, hasn't it, Kevin, in some way, so we are being. <laughs> well, I think that's why it's delivering, because it's, it's giving us certain stuff, but we're not losing our heads over it. I think we're quite controlled in the way we handle it all, so it goes, actually, they're there, all right, let's give them a little bit more. Thanks, universe. We love you too. Quick profit for big buyers. Yes, yeah, so if you're gonna watch, if yeah. you could watch in the Facebook groups and around, and uh, the ones that don't want to come on and chat, that wait for the video to finish and then press play, so you can watch it all on your own and make your notes and run off. Those are the ones I'm talking to. What? Yes, you're doing it now, aren't you? How do I know you're doing it? I and I, Rastafari. <laughs> it's. Uh, I used to be you. I used to be you. Okay, and uh, we've learned. We've joined up. We've. Uh, we got some strong stuff going off here, I'm telling you now, and, uh, um, and that's just my point. And if you watch Superhuman, you will you will then see how strong it can be without the aptitude and the application of the correct uh, implication of instruments. So yes, when we speak to um, you know the registry general there in the local city and town, and we say, I've got the birth certificate, and remember Smithy's story where he said he went in and he bamboozled them all and they just didn't have a clue and we ended up going to Liverpool and we put all of them on notice and said it's about time to move right now and um, put the needle on the record, they all ran away, come back with a big man and everybody from upstairs had an hour with us and delivered zilch and not once did Liverpool offices and agents there or the local area say oh what you need to do is go to your hospital to get that and, and that's where it resides is in the medical record so um i couldn't do that because my hospital was shut so um that's why we're here to help you out because uh, you need to be with us and it looks like we're going to the kingdom of heaven in december but we're not using religion to get there you feel me <laughs> <laughs> i'd like to feel you dave but you're 107 miles away Man. Oh, shit, I forgot we broadcast in. I thought we was on a private. <laughs> so, we got any more questions? Um, let me see. Have we got anything coming anything? in? Five in the view for the... the uh, they've obviously got the information they need and don't have any questions. They'll be uh, yeah, doing it, applying it. Let us know when you've rung up your uh, hospital and told them what you require. If, you, if anybody is here has got a hospital that is still standing from when you was uh, popped <laughs> out please give us an update if you don't want to say anything out. <laughs> that's babble that's babble that's what i mean that's proper just right and proper when you were popped out your mum um your mum is uh yeah belly uh, <laughs> kev help um, the queen. if you You've don't out the queen. <laughs> if you You've don't want to queen. just let me finish this because i'll forget sorry it. sorry gosh <laughs> If you don't want to speak publicly, especially on Facebook, I can fully understand and so can Kev, then please email david at splspro.com or and or kevin at splspro.com. You can uh, SPLS, same as this one in here, and you can speak to us there. But please come back and do what we're doing and start to give and start to share and watch things change for you. The moment, I'm not saying you all don't, but uh, make a conscious effort, be aware and uh, give us some information. Even a yes will do. Just put in yes, we'll let us know. Well, you know uh, what you know. We know that you've done it and it's gone well. So then uh, we can speak privately. We have the dot com for this, and we will keep away from the trills and the shills and the agents and the slippery creepeth lower things. Certain bits, all right. So we have sanitized our hands once more. Unlike Pontius Pilate, who crucified that uh, fictional character there, um, we will not crucify you. And we will not tarnish you with the asses that are all around. Um, and the fact is, he was not a qualified pilot. No, he wasn't, was he? Well, no. Maybe kind of drilling, pilot drill, you know. <laughs> See, no fiction. Pontius Pilot was no pilot. Pilot. He was a bit of a, yeah. a, bit of a ponce, though. <laughs> 
Let's see more questions and thank you all. Are we talking about the BNF or is it something? What's BNF? BNF? Bravo. Yeah, you've got me there. Why? We're doing so well. Does the hospital What's have the its own registers? Uh, uh, Ahmed, we can't help you if you're going to make things up. <laughs> <laughs> Only joking, brother. And yeah, to, we can't help you with fictional, imaginative things. We don't know that we, you haven't even explained to us. <laughs> What's a BNF, mate? Or is that a, is that a typing typo? To Nick, I'd like to while we're waiting for a brother there, um, Ahmed, uh, does the hospital have its own registrars? Yes, it does. It has a registrar. Um, general, I believe. A registrar a... general, yeah. and then you'll have a registrar for each consultant. Nick's clever. Each department. Look at Nick's mind working here. You see yeah, what Nick's, Nick's doing? Star. Look at Nick him. Nick knows, Nick knows. Nick, Nick, Nick. He really knows, mate. Yes, they have a star of the Sharp legend. Bait. <laughs> <laughs> Not sharp bait. Ooh, ha, ha. <laughs> yeah, this one, you're gonna. this is the opposite, where you get on that turtle's back and you hit the self-stream... Um, <laughs> What is it, that flow there that they get on and he goes, woohoo, yeah? <laughs> yeah. We're on the current, the hot current that goes round that's disappeared now, um, but that South Atlantic current that they go to. Oh, you're talking about El Nino. Yeah. Um, yes. That's where we are. Nick, you're a bright spark. Why do, you, why do you think everyone, Nick's thinking about registrars? Registrar, let's think, a general surgery. A general is in the, in the, in the, oh, it's like the church and the state and the law and the. Yeah, they've just got better uniforms, that's all the difference is. So the official act indeed is done in the hospital. Okay, YouTube's going to be coming alive again. I can see the video is spewing out already, but uh, I would argue, we would argue uh, collectively that there are two types of registrars and aren't there? There's a registrar of live birth at the hospital and then everybody goes away and some months, weeks later, um, mum and dad decide, or mum, uh, as it is often now, sadly, um, to go in under duress, under threat, under force, legal requirement. Oh, it's a legal requirement. Well, better go and do it then, you know, like the electoral roll. Blah, blah, blah. And uh, you give up. Um, non-disclosed so none of it stands we can quash it we can dissolve it that's the trust technology and what we've shown you there what's been shown to us we've shown to you and uh, the registrar at the bondsman office the general registry office now registry for what oh that'll be the treasury treasury of whom the people uh, yeah or the queens <laughs> yeah because i've got to work out how much value you've brought to the country you see how much you're going to be worth and add that to the books get you on that stock exchange as quick as possible get people trading livestock yeah yeah livestock oh. exchange yeah so sec i like that uh, do we contact them ring your hospital nick and say i was uh, wherever you were um, but you are saying the home birth aren't you so um you would uh, do what uh, ring the hospital and ask the hospital what would have most likely happened and where the paperwork would have ended up. So wherever you was, um, you know, given life and born, then you would ring up that county town, borough, city hospital, yeah, if you can find that out. And then you'd ask them, wouldn't you, if they're not there. I'm not really sure. One minute, just checking my soul there. Just turn it on. It's still got registered. Hmm. Yeah. Ultimately, did, did you? I'm making the assumption, Nick, that you've got a birth certificate. So, even though, like me, I was born at home, um, ultimately, some days later, my criminal parents <laughs> went and gave me away to the state, hence I've got a certificate. But, you know, I've still got the certificate. It's just that the first part of it wasn't done in the hospital. But I imagine somewhere down the line, the heel prick and all that was done, the Guthrie card, the soul prints. So that's got to be somewhere. And the hospital will know. There's no point me and Kev guessing this and saying, ring, don't ring the National Office of National Statistics. See the dyslexia? I've said it probably 10 times now and it still won't have it. Then ring the ONS <laughs> and uh, after the hospital. If the hospital don't give you any joy, not just for Nick, for everybody in this same situation. Um, ring up the... Uh, and only for uh, Britons, um, England, you know, UK issues. So if you're in another state, uh, whatever, we can't help you with that. This is 
um, you know, just for this landmass. Yeah. And you ring up the hospital after, and after them, if there's no joy, ring up the uh, ONS, and then uh, after that, get back to us and uh, inform us on what you found, please, Nick. Privately would be nice, and then we'll work out how to bring it out, and uh, we'll publish something, so then everyone can... Yeah, I've got to do it myself, Nick, to be honest with you. Yeah. Uh, and I'm under the impression that the registration office in in or about Ilfracombe, so I think it might have been Barnstaple being the next major town, um, burnt down many, many years ago. So it's going to be interesting to see what they can do for me. I don't know that to be true, but I was informed by someone. Um, so here's come back in. He says, B BNF day, birth notification form his battery died as he was typing <laughs> oh no he's been looking it up he's like oh no what's BNF I've said something the yeah, yeah. I've got to find the what was it died. Come it. Google Google what was it <laughs> um, we could fill that so many ways Ahmed I'm just joking <laughs> brother of course yeah we are joking especially with <laughs> here. I, I, I personal that this, this man is highly intelligent knows what he's doing I'm just I'm just an arse <laughs> taking the piss <laughs> It's called, I referenced it, not as the birth notification form, but yeah, um, that may be what it's known now. It's, uh, it's been known to me and to others as a live, because we say it's a live birth. Remember a birth and what it means, but just bear with us while we get to the end. It's, uh, it's the same thing, yes. Respect. Yeah, I don't know if he's... he's to be honest with you, I, I'm, I'm not sure, is that, uh, as far as I know, is that BNF, is that a modern wording for it? Yeah. Um, I, I'm not questioning you, I'm just saying, I honestly don't know, I've not heard it called that before. Certificate of live birth, Guthrie card, which is part of that, that's to say, that's the heel prick uh, with the blood and the soul prints, that's the Guthrie card, that should be attached, I believe, to the... C-O-L-B, or the Colb, the Colb as we like to call it, me and Dave coining phrases, man. But can I just say as well, while we're on this tip, the Office of National Statistics have got an issue because if we can prove that we hold, as the holder in due course, um, an equitable instrument that's called the birth certificate that includes stillbirth and excludes birth, we have got a nation... With nobody, I'm going to claim this landmass. Come on, who's with me? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We need a republic. I wait, since 1060, no, not 1067, since 19, God Lord, 1983, in the place to be. <laughs> since 1940-ish, 37, 30, when, whatever it was, I think three years or two years, maybe 35-ish. When the registration, you should know this is your 101 competence. I've got too much in here. I do know it, but I'm not sure. It's before 40 and after 31, I'll go for 35. Check it. Um, that's when the certification started. Since 1935-ish then, there's been no live men's or very little. So who is here actually right now? Yeah. we in amongst this COVID and this, uh, you know, uh, if we can prove, which we can and Romley and Rowan have had a very good go at it with Queensland and uh, Australia, as you've seen, and others have mentioned it. And um, Liability Mate on YouTube that uh, put those videos out and a few other good channels, um, teachers and preachers on Facebook will um, be taking and looking as well for Anglo. So we can prove outright, which we're going to do um, separately or as one and separately, but together, if you get what I mean, then... Uh, yeah, we can uh, we could claim some land, I reckon, couldn't we? There, if it's a landmass full of uh, uh, dead legal right entities, <laughs> <laughs> we could claim it right up to the border, can't we? <laughs> a we don't want Scotland at the moment. Nothing against the Scots at all, but until that sturgeon's gone. <laughs> Oh, poor Scotland, they're about to um, go with, well, they've been asked to send their, ch their assets, children, back to school today, haven't they? So, I think I, I read Ooh. Aberdeen is on the verge of being locked down again for no reason whatsoever, but there you go. Uh, I don't know how I say, that's just something I glanced past today on Facebook, so how true it is, I don't know. Um, but somebody put up the death numbers. And we're basically going. Here's the numbers they're they're uh, publishing. 
why are they threatening lockdown? <laughs> but then they're doing that all over the place, aren't they? Yeah, madness. It's uh, it's all crazy. We're just we keep out of that. That's something we don't know. We can't know yet. We will not know. Yeah, it's wasted energy, much like the other areas. What we do, if in case you haven't noticed, is get on with business and things that are practical, not divert and yeah. waste and argue and tidbit and no crack on. You lot can be doing that. We've got jobs and targets, uh, military targets. Our eyes are on the corporate city of London as our target. Uh, but we're not going to do anything violent. We wish no ill will, but uh, we are going to deal with them. Oh yes. <laughs> So uh, can we get back on then? Because we're going to be here like an hour and a bit here, Kev. We've done a good 40 minutes. More qu- Any more final questions on the uh, attainment of one's live birth certificate and uh, BNF now then? Uh, give us a yeah, question. Yeah, I'm to coin a new phrase to here. You're the star. That's it. Let's put copyright to here next to that. BNF. Birth, birth notification form. Yes, I uh, live birth. You see, we only need to use one. And BNF, with all due respect, is a bit... Uh, foreign lingo to I and the, the movement, the research, the sovereign initiative, the sovereign initiates, scholarly initiates. Come on, Russell J. Gold. Sovereign against sovereign. Who will win? Harry Hill can be the banker on the bench. Within the corner on the left, we've got crazy Jeremita of the sovereign UK Anglo tribe. <laughs> and then we bring in Gold with his beard and his, uh, and his books and his letters and a sovereign it against sovereign. The Smackdown. Oh, yeah, he's suffering. I'm a thief. Thief. Like two, like two wild gazelle banging heads. <laughs> That's what you're getting for three hours on a hangout. <laughs> Who is the best? Sorry. <laughs> yeah. You've got a choice to make, fam. You've got a choice to make. Yeah. We're not telling you what to do, but uh, we'll give you some information, by all. Sorry about that little outlet of language that you may have heard from me i do apologize at this time of day i just read nick's last post so i'm afraid the f word was just just naturally fell out of my face unbelievable good luck with that i like the facebook messages when you when you just turn it on to come on and it says hello are you feeling all right have you any symptoms of i'm like covid analytica oh. covid analytica is this what it is now we didn't learn from cambridge yeah. i'm gonna freely volunteer don't you even think about it is what i would say Kev. <laughs> yeah, absolutely <laughs> um yeah Could you give us some data oh yeah because you're so trustworthy with data facebook that's the first thing i'm gonna do <laughs> seen those posts going about oh we can monitor your health you send us a drop of blood every month i've just been into several of them i've actually made a post on my own timeline that shows you my comment i mean yeah i know what's a good idea let's all send our dna to a random private company what could go wrong they didn't bother responding (laughs) oh this is where we're at not only are people, man's put in their own private lives and think, you know, years ago, you could, you could, you just couldn't get this information. People kept shit to themselves and they were private and uh, they, uh, you know, uh, when you go in someone's house, you may see a sign. I go in a uh, few uh, travelling around and I like the Jamaica sign. If you come here, what you see here, what you speak here, what you do here, you will leave here. Otherwise, don't come back. Jamaica. I was like, wow, I've seen that <laughs> a few times now. Yeah, you can say and do pretty much. We won't censor you. Facebook might have a different opinion on that. But yeah. you come in here and say, you're like, James and Lisa, uh, what is it for you? Afternoon? How many hours away from us are you? All the way up there. You've got to be getting on for a few, haven't you? What, seven, eight, maybe a bit more? Good to see you. Uh, yeah. I don't see why that is. You've only got to say that you get anxious and you, you're exempt. So I've had a little interaction with the local chemist recently who I had some respect for. 
and uh, unfortunately he removed all of that respect in one fell swoop so I let him have it in front of all the customers and made him look a right penis and he didn't like that so then he decided to call me a conspiracy theorist and now I pointed out actually everything I've just told you you can go and check it's got nothing to do with conspiracy theories but I hope it made you feel better <laughs> yeah <laughs> Well really, played. he was trying to belittle me, and he came knocking on the wrong door there. So, can't wait for a second visit. <laughs> Nine hours, there you go. Fair play. Look at Michael's comment there. He's noticed in the shops a marking who goes in with a mask or yeah. not. Hello, James and Lisa, by the way. What, what? Yes. Yeah, busy time for these people. I've seen all-night fishing sessions. Was it somebody's birthday that I missed? I need to say happy belated birthday to... Was it somebody like James or Lisa? Or was that somebody else, Kev? Oh, it was James's 69th birthday. Just, just till the day. But there I think it was the day before. There we go. Many happy returns. Happy returns, James. Fair play to you. Sprightly 39, he looks. Ha! <laughs> After out there dodging bears, felling trees, and getting on sledges, oh, and yeah, three months, is it? <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. Did you see uh, Lisa lost her bracelet while fishing? So immediately I was thinking, well, no wonder you were catching so many fish. Because the, the Gans was in the water. Oh. That's why the fish were there. So I think, I think our sister Lisa may need another bracelet. We might have to uh, facilitate that. Easy. Yes, we'll sort that out. Yeah, you know where we are. Get an email sent to remind me, and uh, I'll, we'll talk about the uh, the gangs and that later. But yeah, they're in touch with us and in the private with us, aren't they? So we will look after you. We got plenty more here. There's loads of it. Yeah, I'll get some. Uh, we'll get you some sent up. So once more from the top, we've located the live birth certificates for the UK Anglo Britons, a Brit on the land, and um, it comes from your hospital. If the hospital is not there. You need to then perhaps um, look at ringing the Office of National Statistics, ONS, and say, I'm trying to get in touch with these, they're not there. Uh, or if the hospital's not there, before ringing the ONS, uh, perhaps look for a new hospital and ring them and say, have you got the archives and the records from the other hospital where I was born at? Yes or no? And they will answer you. If it's yes, happy days. If it's no, then probably give the ONS a call because he was very helpful he loved it. He absolutely, I'm like, I could stay and talk for, if I said, you got some time? I he goes, oh no, they're all recorded these calls and I'm marked on such and such. And I'm like, I can sit, yeah. he was, you know, he was like, I'd love to. He said, I'll look at all this later and thank you very much. Uh, and I thought, does he know everything? Are they told, you know, you might get some well, weirdos <laughs> ringing up. I'd have jumped in there and said, okay, um, it, take down my private number and give us a ring after work. <laughs> That's what I'd have said. Yeah, I know. And it's, uh, I was focused though in in the in the zone, but uh, yeah, I know, mate. It's just yeah. you know, when you come across the people, you think, oh, okay. it's like I said to you the other night when I went out the other Saturday <coughs> night. On the way out, taxi driver. Oh my God, uh, the knowledge he had. Uh, Muslim guy. Not. Don't get me wrong. I'm just pointing out a fact. Uh, nothing to do with race or anything like that he was a muslim man and he was on it then when we come home we got another guy who was like right up there with the ecclesiastical stuff it was just incredible absolutely incredible London taxi drivers uh, taking around the bar members to their uh, meetings and overhearing shit, you know what I mean? Oh, I, yeah. easy, all right, Marlene. <laughs> <laughs> you know. um, and if you can't, uh, for whatever reason, uh, speak in the public, you know where to get us in the private and we will honour the confidentiality as we have done for the last how many years and, you know, managed it well here. So we'll continue to look after you in the private and the public. Um, even though we've no obligation, but we do in the sacred side of it, unlike the others that find stuff and disappear, keep it to themselves and sell it and stuff. So if you get stuck and you have no uh, way or means of finding out, then we will assist and help. Or you can put on the thread, yes or no, if you found it, if you obtained it, you know, it's not a data breach of any kind. You can say, thank you. Yes, I have my live, you know, because this is going to go around the realm because the ones that don't know, don't know, and the ones that know, don't tell anyone, so 
that's where we're at, unfortunately. Um, and uh, yeah, there's no other findings of mine or Kev's at the minute or the, you know, the trusts that we can give you and go to the hospitals, then the Office of National Statistics and then and come back and let us know and we'll assist you further if you can't. Yeah. Um, you know, in the meantime, a live, uh, a live, an autographed, uh, natural flesh and blood, Woman's uh, thumbprint and uh, will, testamentary, uh, you know, testator and uh, testamentary um, wills there. Um, I think, therefore, I am witnessed by two men is equivalent to a fact uh, in, at law. So if um, you testify and uh, put down and express and powers of attorney, um, last will and testament, you can go so far, evidence of life and essence. So it's not the be all and end all, but if there is stuff out there we need to collect up, then let's collect it, eh? Absolutely. Let's make some discoveries. Come back with people. Go out. Go ask the questions. Come back if you get any problems. That's where we'll be waiting to help should that situation arise. But, you know, this is first hand from, from Dave. First hand. You can't get it any better than that. And it only happened yesterday, so we haven't sat on it for months and months before releasing it. So, no. No, As I say, go and see if you get any issues. If you get any issues, let us know and and we shall formulate some next steps. Maybe no problem. Turn it home next to the hospital, maybe the registrar there. Yeah. Yes, ask, ring around, that's it. Get all the numbers, do your duck duck searches and uh, get the numbers or whatever your preferred search yeah. engine of choice is and then start ringing and... Uh, in the order of what you think is best, Lindsay, and then any problems, let us know. You're on the dot com, so hit, yeah, message on there, um, or email, whatever you want. I'll give you priority because you have helped us out immeasurably. Um, Lindsay of the Stainton Warrior Family, yes. massive, you're a legend. Um, like many on this thread now, the eight or so that have popped in, um, you're all legends in your own right. But Lindsay has gone out of her way to help us. Ahmed, um, legend, Joe. Who else was there? Someone called Nick, I think, somewhere there. Yeah. She's a bit of a legend in his own legendary haircut. Mr. St- oh, he's <laughs> set, in, set in stone. <laughs> he's a unique... Uh, he is. He's a unique um, uh, um, bonce, that is. Barnet, isn't it? <laughs> Burnside. But, yeah, no problem. You're all welcome. Um, Kevin and I are here to uh, assist as best as we can, but uh, we're getting attacked. Our, weak, our kindness is not weakness, and... Uh, Things are going a bit wrong here and there, so we're here to do a little bit of correction, if that's all right, yeah. Yeah, it's all good. It's all good. And yes. a bit of a, yeah, some disappointing interaction from people. No, I honestly had a, the one person in particular today that I sort of had a lot of respect for, but the last few weeks they've been a bit weird. I sort of said to Dave, I've, I've, I've snoozed at XYZ for 30 days. I can't. You did, yeah. You know, I can't cope with it at the moment. I just don't know where they're coming from um, and the stuff that's coming out. And then I was thinking, well, I think the snooze is nearly up. And then today they presented themselves on a joke post. And it is a joke post. It's on my time. There's two. But it's the one about the White House and Joe Biden being told... Um, by a hundred uh, black male leaders that he must choose a black female VP. So I've just gone off and found some images and then said, and here's, here's the new VP. And then somebody comes, it's clearly a joke, can't be anything else. I've made it all up myself, screenshotted the pictures, don't we joke? comes in with serious comments and I'm just like you you have just made the decision for me to block you permanently goodbye although there was a little comment just prior to that where I said you may leave but not in those words I just can't be doing with it people are just unbelievable as I say I had a lot of respect for her 
I think there's um, these times at the minute with the government, Matt Hancock, Boris and uh, Gove Cummings. Hey, when we can't see, we'll come on the news and admit to a crime live on national television. That's how blasé and protected we are. Crown agents at their finest. We can't see. We all go for a drive. Here we go. Look, boys, what do you do when you can't see? Well, we get in the iron horse and go and steam it down the road. And if we can't see, we'll soon find out, won't we? Eh? By Jove, aren't we clever? <laughs> They don't know what they're doing. The, 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 this uh, ongoing uh, issue crisis uh, is it real? It looks the way they're handling it. I'm quite, uh, I'm quite relieved that it's not as potent as it seems to be. Because if it was, I think that uh, that figure of zero on the landmass would be an actuality now, thanks to the mishandling and the, 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 the just the, you know the things that tweet that I retweeted. They opened a website to give um, bikes away. We broke within an hour. They said, if you're fatties and you like fatty, 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 we're not being for sizes here. They said, if you are overweight and obese and, um, you know, whatever, you get ill, you're going to more likely die because your body can't cope with it. So you all need to lose weight. But here's some vouchers. Go and get a burger. What? The? Yeah, go and have some free burgers on us <laughs> down at the healthy burger store. Oh. And, and that, side, that side didn't break down, did it? No, the bike one did. The healthy one. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, there's 15 million burgers being munched just in the last three weeks, or oh, three days, whatever it is. It's only been out a week, hasn't it? So, um, well done to us all for, uh, you know, having the comedy factor, looking after yourselves. It's obviously, the elderly have taken a massive hit by the mismanagement there. That was a, you know, we're not here for that. So, uh, but life and death, birth certificates, it's, it's all relevant. These lot um, in the corporate area of UKG, um, this is why we want to leave you. Um, you've really helped us out here as well because never have we been so busy and so many people seen the truth at once at the same time. I think there's people are pissed off, scared, anxious, um, a lot of things and that may have been um, indicative of that behaviour that we've seen today. We're worried about mental health. We're worried about a lot of areas, um, depression, health, uh, society, a lot of serious big areas. So we're doing this for you to, uh, to lift your morale, to uh, help you out. And uh, to show you that it's not all about private and £12 a year for a donation to SPLSpro.com, who's going to be in their fourth year this December. Oosh. <laughs> so here we go. And hopefully four years in, we'll go to the private exodus, to the land of milk and honey, um, kingdom of heaven on earth. Jesus, I am of this world. I play no part of it. That's us. Get ready. <laughs> well, hopefully, we, if it, you know, if everything pans out the way we'd like it to, I'm not saying want it to, like it to, yeah. <laughs> we'll all be on private service, in the private, doing whatever the heck we like. <laughs> well, yeah, to a limit, yeah, you know, just about, we won't be monitored and all that business because we're self-governing, oh, we self-regulated, self-governing, conscionable, doing whatever we like that way, yes, yeah, not that it's a, I know what you mean, brother, but others interpret that as, oh, we can do what we want, Dave and Kev said, no, what we mean is, there are limitations and boundaries, but it kind of is unregulated until you breach the common law, the trust, the public trust, or you commit harm, injury yeah. and loss, then you got no protection, it's, uh, it's business time. <laughs> certainly is questions yeah, Mike, Mike, I think Mike was uh, Mike saw the post Mr Barnes there he saw the post I put up earlier I don't know if you I saw the person come in and comment um, but I was polite at first it was a bit of a serious comment to make on a joke post <laughs> yeah like, oh, oh here I am wet lettuce leaf wet lettuce leaf ah back off you could have scrolled past you didn't have to make a comment. Yes, that's it. You've got now good to your say. Your actions, you are responsible for your actions. Unfortunately, your actions make me tell you to fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> it's, um, yes, uh, I'm not going to say what I was going to say. It's a long time. I bet your food's turned up, hasn't it, eh, brother? You see your lady oh, there, right. It was for Anne. Anne's happy. Oh. She's all happy because the food turned up. I'm sitting outside. Yeah. She got fed. Oh, she's showing me the the Winston Churchill sign what's that for? Victory she's finished <laughs> oh I think she might have been the wrong way <laughs> oh mirror reflections yeah you're looking through the glass open doors it's that way round it's that way round not that way round thank you for 
The top comment, James and Lisa, David and Kevin, serotonin boosters. Uh, boost for it, there, there. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, We're trying, Mike. we do try. <laughs> yeah, Mike was in the in there. Just, just pointless. Absolutely pointless, you know. I made a, it's a joke. You can't even go to the post. It come from the Washington or the White House something or other. But you can't, like, if you click on it, it just shows you the picture. It's not like a link or anything. Oh, it's clearly, I've made a joke, and obviously somebody felt they had to make an absolutely pointless intrusion. Unreal. Yes, Nick. Yeah, that's what I'm waiting for, Mike. Oh, exactly what I'm waiting for. Oh, he told me to fuck off. Well, you, don't, you could have scrolled past. Be responsible for your own actions. You caused me to tell you to go away in not so many nice words. I'm sick. I'm 54 years old. I'm not putting up with non. I don't need to. Yeah. I don't need to put up with nonsense from idiots. Go away. Yeah, yeah, that's Too it. Too long in the tooth. End the story. Go and annoy somebody else. Go and make pathetic comments on somebody else that will fawn around to you. You've come. You're knocking on the wrong door here. That's right. So uh, um, <laughs> you reap what you sow, and uh, yeah, there's some excuses I could say for uh, what what it is and how it is. But uh, um, no, um, I know the individual you're on about, and I feel that too. Uh, um, there are snide jibes. Uh, there was a comment in the thread I was in the other day, weren't it? And he said, um, he said, um, well, people, if they just keep it to, if they, I wish people would share the information. I've got the uh, um, um, David L. Evans asked the questions about the direct debit. That's right. Um, constitution banking constitutional remedy that's not homegrown by man that's a public um, direct debit uh, clawback indemnity scheme run by the banks made by the banks enforced by the government and the banks actually after certain errors and frauds have been disclosed so um, then in the thread this lad said you subscriber user said yeah I've got what you need personal message me and I'll give it you after saying he wishes people would share information and it should be common knowledge so I said Yes, forgive me, I haven't done it yet, but we have got the details for the direct debit indemnity clawback and it's public banking government constitution policy, not private stuff that's been scripted by man at uh, three o'clock in the morning for three weeks until he gets it right. That's the difference there, which is why we are, as, as an author, as the owner, whatever, we keep that private because we've learned. People come along, they take, and you don't see them again. Next thing, the secret groups made and etc. And um, people selling stuff and slagging other people off and, you know, egos and images. So we just thought, uh, we'll go to our own place, remove ourselves from that. And, uh, you know, it's just very sad, isn't it, to, in that way, um, how it's become. But that's not everybody, but just be aware, yeah, just uh, guard yourselves is what we say now, yeah. <laughs> and watch yeah, out for them. Easy. Unfriend them. It's... Just unfriend them, yeah. innit? Get rid just of unfriend them. Unfriend them. Have done with it. It's not worth your time. Don't get wound up about it. They're not worth it. Just give them the old heave ho and move on in your life. Imagine Don't let the buggers get to you. You all have probably met us, so we're going to wrap up and get off soon because I need to eat, shower, and everything like that. And yeah, it's me just too, yeah. too hot. But imagine when you've all met an arsehole, but when you meet them, think of somebody you don't like who's done you wrong. All right, that's really done you wrong. That's somebody that you could get and uh, and have strong words with for a long time. Okay, um, I know we're all peace and love and pass. Yeah, I am, but there's people that have wronged me that I still have got to, you know, to deal with in my mind. So I'm not a saint. I'm not perfect, but I'm dealing with it and it's working well. So you've all got uh, somebody in mind like that. Imagine now when you first met them. And how that goes, you know, when you meet a passive aggressive or a, a psychopath, they don't tell you that at first. Rapists <laughs> and that, they come across as. They're not wearing a badge. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Facebook, it's full of it. Um, the rapists, therapists. <laughs> the, <laughs> enough said. The rapists, yeah. yeah. Therapists, I said. They're in the trying to. Yeah, go on. <laughs> psycho the rapist. <laughs> yeah, psycho therapist. Psycho therapist. <laughs> it's a nice DJ name, that. <laughs> yeah, I was going to go with CKV. Oh. <laughs> On topic with CQV versus CKV, who yeah, will K, win? Because it's pronounced K, so it's the KV. Oh, it's fucking, it's just brrilliant. I just don't know how I am not on the throne of England. I just don't understand it. I'll get Harry Hill in to see CKV, CQV. Who will win, Harry? Let's go. Kev, it's going to be a sweaty one. <laughs> I'm sweating. 
to your bath and sitting out here that I've got sweaty tits. Well, I've got sweaty tits. <laughs> Hello, I've, Flat Boy. I've got tits and moves. <laughs> Flat Boy's in. He said oh, he's there. i just seen him. Easy. Thank you for that comment, Nick. Um, that's it then. I think we've covered everything. I'm. Uh, we've done an hour or so for a half an hour sesh. We've taken your questions. We've given all the information you need. Enjoy the quest for your live birth certificate uh, of that event. I don't think it's uh, anything to do with you as such. It doesn't identify you or anything. You know, it's... Uh, yeah, it's, uh, we'll sort that out later. But, uh, yeah, enjoy that. And, uh, Kev, you want to say anything else? Or? Yeah, well, just thank you all for this... It's been a laugh. Quite enjoyed it, actually. Suffering in the heat a little bit, I'll be honest. Um, but all good. Thank you very much for joining us. Hope you've had a bit of a giggle. I certainly have. Sorry. Come find us again. You know where we are. Nice one, yes. Thank you, brother. I uh, echo that. Thank you. Much love. Thank you all, and uh, we'll see you soon. Um, we'll be next... Uh, updating text all right so we'll look forward to the interactions on here feedback um if you want to post us anything like i say please do that and let us know how uh, how it goes and if you don't post anything and uh, you keep it to yourself that's what we expected also <laughs> <laughs> we know some of you will some of you will we know that yes it's all good the right ones always present themselves that's what we're finding. Yeah. Or are presented to us, indeed. As is some brilliant information this year, although we've had this sort of bit of, bit of quiet during this <laughs> COVID knowledge, this, this, this non-existent bollock. But yes, it's, it was a great year up until about March, wasn't it? Things were rocking. <laughs> then we've had the brakes put on. But then we've had some, we still had some great information brought to us and and we've released. So, yeah, it's been really good. Yeah. Yeah, you have a great day too, James and Lisa. I, I don't know if you've got a relaxing one on. I doubt you've got <laughs> any of that going on for a month or two of you while you, you prepare for the rest of your year. Amazing people. Incredible. Much respect going out to you two and your families and friends that, that live that lifestyle. That's just incredible. Nothing but admiration for you. Mm, amazing. Yeah, it is incredible. Hard work. How many months you got to prepare for the rest of the year? Let's just make England Anglo feel a bit better about themselves. You got um, three months, is it, to get ready? And then That's nine three months? months? Yeah, maybe. Three months to prepare to be, to, yeah, live for the other nine. How incredible. Whereas I thought, oh, there's nothing in the fridge. It, it's in November. <laughs> you ain't going down the supermarket, I can tell you. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine the party you could have on a nine-month night out. Wow. Oh, I tell you what, a... I tell you what we'll do. We'll plan this I, one. I'm not brave in Alaska. <laughs> The Guinness World Records. When we find the uh, private, James, Lisa, when, when, not if, when we're in the private and it's all done and dusted and uh, the music stops playing, the music isn't going to stop playing and the lights aren't going to come on. You know when I say, when the music stops playing and the light comes on and it's the end, you've got to face reality. You can have nine month escape, celebration. Obviously not nine months, but I'd like to come up for a, for a wee while and uh, uh, um, bring some of the fam and... Uh, <laughs> experience that maybe see them aliens and green people in the roads and you know <laughs> yeah <laughs> have a bear chasing your ass down the ice <laughs> for a bit of reality <laughs> yeah <laughs> bless i all right then so thank you much love enjoy that you're welcome we love you see we don't leave you out not like the others say and uh thank you we'll see you soon let's go kev Cheers to everybody. Much love to each and every one of you. See you soon.